Okay guys, welcome back to episode 6 of the Evolve Alpha. I've unlocked a new medic character called Lazarus. Uh, let's see what he can do. So let's select him. And I've got a new ability which was reduce damage. Um, I think I'll stick with my jetpack to be fair because I'll probably take less damage from doing that. So this is the first time I've played as him. Uh, I don't know what his abilities are. I don't know what kind of weapons he's got. I saw there he's got something called the Lazarus device, which I assume brings dead people back to life straight away. That would be a, a frontal get of it. But whether or not that's true is. Up for debate, as we'll find out in a minute. So, he looks like a bit of an old coot. I've seen loads of other. Uh, loads of other alternate trappers and, you know, all that kind of thing, but I don't think I've seen an alternate healer so I'm quite looking forward to seeing what this guy will be like Lazarus is the medic. He keeps the team alive. The Lazarus device can be used to bring teammates back from the dead. Use the personal cloak to hide yourself when in danger, or to stealthily revive teammates. The sniper rifle is rapid fire, leaves no tracers, and creates weak spots on the monster that teammates can target, all without making a ruckus. As the medic, Use the healing burst to keep yourself and nearby hunters alive. If the medic falls in battle, the team is sure to follow. Stay alive, medic. Okay, so what I gathered from that is that the right sniper rifle is gone from bolt action to semi auto. Perhaps we should try to be a lot a better. Monster. Bring it back to the ship. Study our living specimen. <laughs> I thought Mr. Parnell said no using your glove thing on dead monsters. Oh, you know about that. If you are worried about us telling on you, do not be. Because if you bring a dead monster back to ship, bring it back to life, there will be no need to tell anyone anything. Fine. Limit imagination. Okay, so the Lazarus device, as I predicted, brings characters straight back from the dead. So if I can go to their body, and after they've been completely wiped out by the monster, I can bring it back. Uh, sniper rifle, semi auto, and. Uh, is a lot more productive and better at what you're after, which is kind of a good news because that bolt action was cool but not not effective. And the personal shield is going to be a lot better for trying to pick people up. So let's go on with the gameplay and let's see how this character plays out. I like the sniper rifle a lot better. It's, it creates a mass of weak spots. Trapper needs to hurry up and get his ass in gear. Because I am sick and tired of trying to... I think he's going up here. There he is. I am here. Oh, what's going on with my team? We're not even fighting the monster and people are dying. Uh. 
now I've lost him, so I have no idea what's going on. Reaver's here. This is pathetic. This is. Got this area monitored. You're all right. You're not doing nothing. Flipping idiot. Oh, great. I suppose they ain't going to help me out this either. Nah, just going to stand there? Yeah? Just going to stand there while I die? Yeah, massive plan. Cheers, douche. Fucking idiot. This regen AoE is a lot quicker because obviously he's got no personalised medgun. So I can't singularly heal people. Uh, where are the birds taking flight then? My team is completely and utterly useless. I don't know what they're doing. That's him. Team, what are you doing? Alright, okay. So it looks like he's taken the right way. I need to get close to him to use my heal on him. Enough. Feel free to die. Um, can't tell if big man's gone up or down. Oh, she's gone left. So he's now evolved. So I'm going to sneak around the left side. Yep, I can hear it coming. Alright. Smashing shout with that uh This rebel guy is doing quite well. He seems to be the only one on my team that has a clue what he's doing. up with him. Oh, I'm trying to cut him off to the left. Oh, 
I want there to fight with him. Crap, thanks for fucking telling me. God damn it. icon you can see on the uh, as the monster icon is I believe bucket uh, bucket skill uh, and it's a trucking door which is a lot more helpful than everything else and I did not mean to press that button Personal shield comes back a little point, but not too not too slightly. Oh, I can hear him. I think he's going left. Ah, there he is. First, the creature must be there. Oh, come on, if people can't even... Like, this is the only reason I don't think I've played this game at launch, is because it is just a cat and mouse around the map. Um, that's not really how I want to spend my time in the game. So he's on the power relay and everyone on my team has no idea what the fuck that is. So it seems like we are going to absolutely get ruined by this thing. Because he's got enough health to just sponge everything. Alright, this is good. This is good. Shield failing! Yeah, this is a good. I am 
That's it. Come on and Lazarus device and back from the dead. There we go. That's how you play Lazarus. So let me weaken him down a little bit. Come on, and he's up. I am just surviving by the skin of my teeth. Put some more weeping nodes on him. I am down, but the monster is basically dead. Yes, fantastic. Now I find that not being able to singularly heal people. Even though that was pretty useless, like the gun itself didn't heal fast enough. Um, not being able to singularly heal is a massive pain in the ass. Uh, that's going to be a good uh, level increase. Um, so yeah, I kind of like Lazarus. Uh, Lazarus. Um, oh, leveled up like crazy. Leveled up twice in that game from him, so he's a powerhouse. Look at that, even all the way there. Jesus Christ. So he has his own um He has his own challenges. Wow. Ha <laughs> did that in one game. Okay. That was a smashing game, that was. So yeah, that was the game with Lazarus. Uh, that is his role within the team. Thanks for watching. Uh, please like the video if you liked it, and please sub for the channel for more. See you in the next one.